Hey guys, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to clone yourself. And we're doing it all inside of After Effects. Let's go. Alright guys, I'm here in After Effects and we're going to need three clips for this effect. So the first one is your first actor, the second one is your second actor, and then the third one is you want to make sure to have a clean plate, which is at the end of the video just walk behind the camera for a second or two and get it to where we can capture the clean plate. So you can see this clip I've titled Person 1, so we're just going to cut out the parts where Person 1 is acting. So I think that starts right here, and then it ends right here. Just like that. Okay, now we can do person two. So just duplicate this and rename it just like that. And now we are going to find where person two X. Start here and ending it right here. So now if we turn down the opacity on this clip, you can see it makes it kind of see through. And we're just going to line these up so the timing fits. Okay, so now I'm just going to trim the composition to that selection. Just like that. So now we have person one and person two. And then the final thing we need is a clean plate. So we can duplicate this layer and name it clean plate. And then also this got changed to person three. Just rename that. Okay, so now on clean plate, you can go ahead and put it in solo mode by clicking this icon right here. And that'll make it to where that is the only thing that you see. So you can see right here, we have a pretty good clean plate. So we're just gonna right click time and select freeze frame just like that now the entire length of this video is just that one frame also now you can take it off solo mode okay so in order to make it to where we don't look like ghosts and we're all see-through what we want to do is make masks around each character that way they're separated from the other side it's pretty simple actually you're just going to press g on your keyboard or you could select this icon right up here and then i'm going to just make a little selection right around this character awesome now turn up the opacity we already have somewhat of a cloning effect but you can see right down here we get these harsh edges so in order to do that you're going to go to the person one clip or whichever clip you put the mask on and double tap in and now you can see Mask Feather appears right here. You're just gonna drag that up. You can see it kind of blends the area. You can see we need a little bit more work here on the shadow. Because you can see it's kind of like clipping on the shadow. And once you get that shadow to where it's not looking like it's clipped off, you're done. Here we go, it's our cloning effect. Hey guys, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to clone yourself. And we're doing it all inside of After Effects. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and now you can go off and make your own clone effect. Peace.